Do you want to change your Windows system language from English to Portuguese, Spanish or any other language? In this video, I'm going to show you how you can change your entire Windows system language with no step skip. So without further ado, let's dive into it. On your Windows 11 operating system, click on start, then click on settings. Here inside Windows settings, click on time and language, then click on language and region. Right here inside language and region, we have three sections. We have language, region, and related settings. We are going to focus on these two main ones here. And the language, the first option that we have here is Windows Display Language. So this is the system default language. And you can see on the right side that mine is set to English United States. If you click on this small arrow, you will see that I have another option here to select, which is Portuguese from Portugal. I'll show you how you can have this or more languages options around here. Below Windows Display Language, we have Preferred Languages. And down here, you can see that I have English and Portuguese. If you want to add a new language, click here, Add a Language. This pop-up window will appear to give you the option to search and select the language that you want to install. Inside this address bar, write the language that you want to install. In this tutorial, for this example, I want to install Spanish. So I'm going to type Spanish. You can see down here that I have Spanish from different countries. Select the Spanish from the country that you want. For this tutorial, again, I want Spanish from Spain. So I'm going to type here Spanish space Spain. Down here, I have Spanish from Spain. Now I'm going to click on it to select. And then down here, I'm going to click next. Here you will see all the optional features related to this language, Spanish in this case. Below, you have the option to set this language as Windows Display Language. If you want to do it now, you just have to click here on this box. For this tutorial, I'll show you how you can set this later. So I'm going to uncheck this. Then let's click on install. So now Windows is going to download and install this language package. Once the download is finished, you can see under the preferred language that I have Spanish as my new language. But right now, Spanish is not my Windows Display language. To make Spanish our system language, let's go up here where we have Windows Display language. On the right side, remember that mine is set to English United States. Click on this small arrow. And you will see here that I have the option to select Spanish as my display language. So I'm going to click here on Sp Spanish. You will get this notification here from Windows saying that Windows needs to sign you out in order to apply your new display language. This doesn't mean Windows needs to restart. It only means that you need to sign out and then sign in again to your system. Before we sign out and then sign in again, let me show you the other options that we have available here. Under preferred languages, you will see that since we have selected Spanish as our Windows display language, it moved from the bottom to the top. Now, as preferred language, the top one is Spanish, then English, then Portuguese. The other thing to note here is that based on this sequence, Microsoft Store apps will appear in the first supported language in this list. That means if you open Microsoft Store, the apps first will prioritize Spanish. If the app doesn't support Spanish, it will go to English. If it doesn't support English, it will go to Portuguese. If you want to rearrange this order, what you can do is just click on the language and drag it to the top this way. Now English will be the first supported language in Microsoft Store. This does not affect the Windows Display language 
which is set to Espanol. Below we have the region section. Here you have country and region. As you can see on the right side, I have mine set to United States. Depending on the country that you select here on the right side, Windows and apps might use your country or region to give you local content. So if you don't want content from the United States, just click on this arrow and select the country that you want. In this case, because we have selected Spanish from Spain, let's select Spain. Under regional format, you can see that mine is set to English, United Kingdom. And this is reflected down here, where I have my time and my dates. As you can see right now, my dates and time are set to 24 hours, day, month, year. If you don't want this type of format, you can click here on this small arrow and select a different format. For this case, let me choose English from United States just to show you the difference. You can see down here that it changed to 12 hour system and to month, day and year. I don't like this format. That's why I have set mine to English, United Kingdom, and I think I'm gonna leave this one this way. These are the main changes that I wanted to share. So now I'm going to sign out and then sign in to show you that the Windows 11 system language has changed to Spanish. So let me do it now. A little longer than a few minutes later. I have signed it out and signed it in again. Now let's go again to settings, click on Windows, then click on settings. You can see now that my system language has changed to Spanish. This is how you change your system language in Windows 11. Well everyone, that's all from this video. I hope you found value and if you did, don't forget, like, share it and subscribe to the channel. I'll see you in the next one. Have a good day.